Heaven's Gate. Heaven's Gate was a cult that emerged in America in the 1970s, created by Marshall Herff Applewhite. He claimed he had a vision about the end of the world and how extraterrestrial life, or should I say aliens, are key to surviving this potential end. He claimed these aliens would come to the aid of the world during this end, but would only save the members of the cult by taking them onto their spaceship, where they would achieve immortality. In 1997, the cult came to a tragic end as the Hale-Bopp comet approached Earth. Applewhite interpreted the comet as a sign of the alien's arrival and the opportunity for ascension to a higher spiritual realm. He basically thought the comet was a spaceship. He convinced his followers that the only way to board the ship was to leave their earthly form. This led them to commit suicide. 39 members of the cult chose to end their lives in a mass suicide by suffocating themselves with plastic bags, as instructed. The Manson Family The Manson Family was a cult led by this guy, Charles Manson, during the late 1960s in California, USA. At the age of 17, Manson already had numerous criminal records for theft, rape, and burglary. He was able to manipulate a group of mostly young, impressionable people who became devoted to him, believing his claims of being a divine figure akin to Jesus. Manson preached about an impending race war, which he termed Helter Skelter, and convinced his followers that they needed to prepare for this apocalyptic conflict by committing a series of brutal murders. He believed that initiating chaos through these killings would accelerate the collapse of society and bring about the end of the world. Among their heinous acts, the Manson family carried out the infamous murders of actress Sharon Tate and several others. In 1972, Manson and some of his followers were arrested and subsequently sentenced to death for their crimes. The Universe People Followers of this movement believe in aliens from distant planets communicate telepathically with them. They believe these aliens visit Earth to guide humanity spiritually and to help humans evolve to a higher level of consciousness. They assert that these advanced beings are good and have chosen certain individuals on Earth to deliver messages about spiritual evolution and the incoming transformation of humanity. The universe people emphasize love, peace, and harmony with nature, advocating for a shift towards a more enlightened and spiritually aware society. Despite skepticism and criticism from mainstream society, the movement has garnered a dedicated following, particularly in Central and Eastern Europe. Followers often gather for meetings, meditation sessions, and discussions centered around their extraterrestrial beliefs and spiritual teachings. Anum Shinrikyo Aum Shinrikyo, also known as Aleph, is a Japanese religious cult that combined elements of Hinduism, Buddhism, and apocalyptic beliefs to attract followers. It was founded by Shoko Asahara in 1984, who claimed to be a reincarnation of Jesus Christ. His followers believed that only by following him could humanity be saved. The religion planned to bring about the end of the world, leaving only their followers as survivors, and then create a perfect world according to their desires. The cult gained notoriety after a deadly attack in a Tokyo subway in 1995, where they released a deadly gas called sarin, which killed 13 people and injured thousands. Despite this, it attracted thousands of members, many of whom were well-educated but disillusioned with society. Asahara was arrested in 1995 after the Tokyo subway serene attack. He was later convicted of numerous crimes, including murder and conspiracy, and was sentenced to death. Asahara remained on death row for many years until he was executed by hanging in July 2018. The Prince Philip Movement The Prince Philip Movement originated on Tana Island in Vanuatu during the late 20th century. Followers of this movement hold Prince Philip, the husband of Queen Elizabeth II, in exceptionally high regard, viewing him almost as a deity. They affectionately refer to him as Islander Brother or Yakel, and believe that he possesses a unique spiritual connection to the mountain spirits. According to their beliefs, Prince Philip is revered as a special figure who departed from Tana to marry a powerful queen. They anticipate his eventual return, expecting that he will bring them prosperity and good fortune. Many followers of the movement eagerly await the day when Prince Philip will come back to bestow blessings upon them. The Movement for the Restoration of the Ten Commandments of God Founded in 1989 by Credonia, Morinda, and Joseph Kibwetir, preached strict adherence to the Ten Commandments. They emphasized the importance of adhering to these commandments in every aspect of life, leading their followers to abstain from activities like talking, eating, and sex. 
fearing violation of the commandments. They also preached about the end of the world, which they taught their followers would occur on December 31st, 1999. Taking advantage of their followers' anxieties, the leaders exploited their fears by insisting on monetary contributions and material possessions to ensure salvation. However, when the anticipated apocalypse didn't occur, disillusionment spread among the members, prompting them to demand the return of their resources. Faced with mounting desperation and anger from their followers, they prophesied March 17, 2000 as the next doomsday. In a twisted celebration, the movement hosted a massive party at their compound. Tragically, the festivities turned to horror as the building erupted in flames, burning all of their followers. Simultaneously, both Morinda and Kibbutir mysteriously vanished on the night of the massacre. Ugandan authorities launched an investigation, uncovering a grim reality. Over 900 bodies, either burned or poisoned, were discovered across properties owned by the movement. It became evident that this was not a case of mass suicide, but a meticulously planned mass murder. The leaders, failing to deliver on their apocalyptic promises, resorted to drastic measures to stage their foretold prophecies, leading to one of the darkest chapters in religious history. The Order of the Solar Temple The Order of the Solar Temple started in Switzerland during the 1980s by Luc Jure and Joseph de Mambro. They mixed Christian, New Age beliefs, and UFO conspiracy theories to create a religious system that attracted followers. Luc Jure and Joseph de Mambro preached a troubling idea. They taught their followers that death was necessary for spiritual salvation. They convinced them that after death, they would transition to a higher realm or a heavenly paradise in form of a planet. Tragically, this belief in the necessity of death for spiritual ascension led to a series of mass suicides and murders within the group in the 1990s. In 1994, a tragic event unfolded in Switzerland where 48 members of the cult were found dead, many of them having been murdered or having committed suicide. Similar incidents happened in Canada in 1995 and France in 1997, where more people died. Luc Jure died in Switzerland and Joseph de Mambro died in Canada. These events shocked the world and brought attention to the dangerous and destructive nature of cults like the Order of the Solar Temple. The Ant Hill Kids The Ant Hill Kids was a religious cult created by Roche Theriot in Quebec, Canada during the 1970s and 1980s. Theriot claimed to be a prophet of God and attracted followers to his commune, which he called the Ant Hill Kids. The group lived in isolation and practiced severe rituals in the form of discipline, which included extreme physical and psychological abuse such as beatings, starvation, and forced amputation of hands, legs, and even private parts, which Theriot believed to be the best practice to purify his followers. Theriot had total power over his followers. He made them do whatever he wanted, which became more and more cruel over time. The group was called the Ant Hill Kids because Theriot thought his followers were like ants working for a bigger reason. The cult's activities came to light in the mid-1980s when one of Theriot's followers escaped and reported the abuse to authorities. This led to a police raid on the commune and the arrest of Theriot and several of his accomplices. In 1989, Theriot was convicted of multiple charges, including murder and sentenced to life in prison. I also made a video where I explained every major religion in minutes. Please like and subscribe.